welcome to this video. Today I'm going to show you how to paint up these awesome Empire Knights from Mini Rat Studio. I'm going to make this a really simple tutorial and I'm going to paint these models in a standard white and red color theme. So this is actually how the miniatures are going to look in the end. The colors I used in this video I'll put down in the description down below. I started priming the minis with the Corex right and afterwards I started using the contrast color called Blood Angels Red. You could also use Memphis Suns Red for example and maybe even highlight it with Evil Sun Scarlet but to keep this video as simple as possible I thought I would use some contrast paints. I used the red color on different parts of the clothing and the lands. Once you're done with your red color, you move forward to use a metal color. You can use either lead belcher or, as I do in this example, I use gun metal from the Army Painter. I use this color all over the barding on the horse and also on the armor on the rider. Then I paint the skin up with Cadian Flesh Tone. And afterwards I started using the first gold color on the minis. For this I used the color Greedy Gold from Army Painter, but pretty much any matte gold will do. Then I started using Null Noi for all the metal parts, uh, that means both the gold and the silver parts that I painted up already. And to start painting the horses and to keep it as simple as possible also, I started using the contrast called Apocrisy White, which I kind of feel like giving the illusions of shadow and also kind of helps with toning down Corex Whites a bit. And then I used Acrex Earth Shade. I used this shade on the red parts and also on the skin color. Then I highlighted the gold parts with Shining Gold from Army Painter. Then I highlighted the barding and the armor with plate metal armor from Army Painter. You should try to use this on spots where the light would be hitting the armor, but since the mini is this small, you don't have to be that precise with this, uh, since the more bright silver color will also help the mini pop a bit more. And then I finished the horse up by dry brushing on some Othean White. If you would like the horse to pop even more, you could try to use white scar or whatever for highlights in the end. But for this video, I feel like it's uh, it's fine for now. Alright, that's it for this tutorial. Thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed. 